Hi there. Now, what I want to show you here is another way that we can integrate this expression here. In the previous video, I showed you how to do it one way, so I'm now going to show you how we can do it another way. And if we just start by taking that integral, the integral of 1 over 1 minus tan x minus 1 over 1 plus tan x, it's integrated with respect to x between the limits pi upon 12 to pi upon 6. And we were asked in a previous part to show that this identity was identical to tan 2x. So we pick up on that, that we can simplify this to the integral of tan 2x integrated with respect to x between these limits pi upon 12 to pi upon 6. Now, one way then that we can do this is by just remembering what the integral of tan of x is with respect to x. It is the natural log of sec of x plus a constant, which I won't put in here, OK? So when it comes to integrating tan 2x, we need to just make an adjustment on this. It's going to be the natural log of sec 2x, but if we were to differentiate this, we would end up with 2 tan x. We just need to get rid of the 2 by multiplying it by a half, OK? So that's where we're going with this version. We're going to say that this is a half times the natural log of sec 2x. I'll put that in brackets there. And this is between the limits then pi upon 12 to pi upon 6. And then it's just a question of substituting our limits in. So we've got the half at the front and we've got the natural log of the sec of two lots of pi upon 6. That's going to be the natural log of the sec of pi upon 3. And from that, we subtract the natural log of the sec of two lots of pi upon 12, which is pi upon 6. And then we've just got the half and the sec of pi upon 3 is 2, so you've got the natural log of 2 minus then, and the sec of pi upon 6 is 2 over root 3. So you've got the natural log of 2 divided by root 3. And then picking up on the division rule here for logs, we've got half the natural log of 2 divided by 2 over root 3, which just gives us root 3. And there's your answer in the form a times the natural log of b.